everyone welcome back to my channel welcome to today's style still finally if you've never seen one of these videos from me i ask you guys which celebrity style you've been loving recently and then i try and recreate the outfits for as affordable as possible did i say that right as a as i don't know if you haven't seen my last one i'm gonna link it down below this week is blackpink i'm so excited because i honestly i love their style and it's I feel like you guys like their style too. When I said I want to see Blackpink, you guys went crazy for it. So I was like, yeah, let's see Blackpink. I'm going to be honest, I don't really follow them for their music. I see I follow their fashion religiously. I really, really like their fashion. So if I say anything that doesn't match their personalities, their voices, their, I don't know, just don't come for me, okay? Because I, I don't know, okay? I just like their clothes. Yeah, I'm going to get straight into things. If you're not subscribed already, I'll give you a couple seconds to do so. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna start off with an outfit I saw on Rosé because it was so cute and as soon as I saw it, I was like, oh my God, I really wanna recreate that outfit. I'll just say that most of these things are from Shein. When I was looking online and like trying to recreate the outfits, every time I searched into Google like tweed dress or white shirt, their option was always the cheapest and I just wanted to keep it affordable for you guys, you know? So sorry if they don't ship to your country or anything like that. I'm pretty sure they ship worldwide. I don't know, but yeah, most of this stuff is from Shein. It's a navy v-neck with a really distressed hem. And then it also has this like really deep purpley detail around the neck as well. That one is Alexander Wang and it's over $400. This one I got on Shein, I'm pretty sure it was like $20 if that. Um, yeah, it's very, very similar. I don't understand. It's very cute, very schoolgirl cutie kind of kind of looks kind of vibes and then she paired it with this pleated skirt which i wore these in summer so much near enough every single day her one is a little bit different to this one hers had more of like a mixed tartan detail i have this one from zara and the colorway is different so this one has blue yellow orange every single freaking color in the rainbow initially when i ordered this i was like the quality is going to be gross because the original zara one here is so thick and so nice it's 50 pounds which you kind of understand why it's very very nice quality so when i ordered this i was like it's going to be see-through it's going to be nah nah it's just not gonna work but the quality of this is actually really really nice and she just wore a little black backpack mine is from fashion drug and she was just wearing white sneakers white socks very very simple you could honestly get them anywhere i have some from reebok i have some from nike opportunities are unlocked okay so the next outfit is one that lisa wore and i found it really really hard to find an outfit that I felt like kind of suited her personality as much as I know it. Some of the outfits that their stylists have put them in for like award shows and stuff like that, I just tell it just didn't really suit her at all. And I think it's so unfair because she's so cute and they just put her in really ugly clothes. But her own personal style when she's going through like airports and you just see her out is the most like mine it's very casual it's very very cool very street style. So the thing that caught my eye was her hat. She was wearing a Louis Vuitton bucket hat which found it online and it was six hundred dollars i was like okay i have to recreate this look like if her hat alone is six hundred dollars i have to recreate this and then i thought like how do you recreate louis vuitton without it being a fake i thought why not go with leopard print it's got the same colors in it it's got the same kind of dotted print shall we say i'm really trying to sell this to you and i don't know if i'm convinced myself but it looks the same from a distance do you know what I mean? It looks kind of similar. This was $10, so an extreme price difference from $600. And I think this is cute. I think this is really cute. And then the t-shirt she was wearing, again, I found it so hard to try and find one that wasn't a replica or an exact fake. As a perfectionist, okay, to not find something and have it look exactly the same is it's challenging. Like, it's played on my mind a lot leading up to this video, seriously. Like, even last night, I was still searching, like, I can find this t-shirt. I just found one that I already had in my wardrobe. Um, again, you guys probably all have a black long t-shirt dress in your wardrobe. But, I mean, it's cute, it's oversized, it's black, it's pretty much exactly the same what she was wearing. This one's from House of Snake, I'll link it down below. The quality is really, really nice. Up is a outfit that Jenny wore. I'm not gonna lie, Jenny fashion-wise is my favourite. Honestly, gets the best outfits, every outfit they put her in, I'm just like, wow amazing outfit i picked because it was so easy to recreate you probably have most of the stuff in your wardrobe already so starting off with this shirt hers is a little bit different hers was double breasted really really hard to find something that was double breasted and a shirt most of them were blazers so i had to start with this but i still you guys get the vibe her shirt is originally from chanel 
I don't know how much that would be, but it was it would be pricey. Simple. And then she also paired the shirt with just a basic pair of denim jeans. These were a monkey, but honestly, again, you probably have these in your wardrobe already. And then lastly, oh, well, this is my favorite bit. What I personally think makes the whole look, and I'm really obsessed with these. Honestly, I love them so much. She was wearing a pair of nude heels, which I actually don't have. Whenever I wear heels, I always wear either black, see-through or snakeskin i've noticed that a lot in my wardrobe her heels i don't think were see-through on the side but i just thought these were so elegant and so classy they just complete the look so these are Peyton nude heels and oh, aren't they pretty i mean these are so pretty i love them so much seriously if you want to elongate your legs a little bit having this see-through detail here really really helps so i wanted to get them to show you guys uh, because i like them a lot and i want them for myself I have these all like breathable bits on the inside you don't see them on the outside because they're on the inside because this next outfit is one that jisoo wore to an event i really hope i said that right i felt like i said it really really wrong i'm not exactly sure the event that she wore this to i'll leave the picture here but she wore this blouse which is originally 750 dollars which is just insane she just a chiffon black blouse which has a lot of ruffle detail to it very see-through as well this i thought was so similar obviously it's see-through so she had a little like boob tube underneath it you can just cut up a vest if need be you could even do a black bra maybe you could even do a lace bra and have a moment for valentine's day again i found this on shein super super inexpensive the quality again really isn't that bad and then the skirt that she was wearing with it was 405 dollars i think i saw and i found one that was honestly exact from asos in the asos package i also bought a pair of jeans that didn't fit and very stupidly yesterday afternoon when i repackaged my jeans to be returned i put the skirt back in there as well i didn't realize until this morning when i went to go and get the skirt and the skirt was gone so annoying because honestly it was pretty much her exact outfit and the skirt was on sale for six pounds on asos so i'm going to link it down below if you did want to recreate the outfit um i'm just gonna have to find a black skirt that i have somewhere in the depths of my wardrobe so yeah i got it so good so close but i sent it back which is great and then lastly because as i've said jenny's fashion is my fave like i really 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 like her fashion i want to do another one of her outfits because again when i saw this on shein i was like hold up so she wore a chanel dress because i'm pretty sure she works with chanel regularly this dress was stunning again i have no clue how much it was um i'm pretty sure some of the stuff is made for her so you can't actually buy it she was wearing a tweed blazer dress which had a really low v yes are you seeing this are you seeing this yes okay piping on hers is different this one's a lot darker i actually think i prefer the piping on this one because this one has blue gold and beige and black running through it and i just think the contrast is really really nice another difference from this one to her one is that this one doesn't have a belt i did try to find one similar but i couldn't get one exact to the piping and it just looked a little bit off so please excuse she also was wearing some gold layered necklaces as well mine are all from the m jewelers but you can also get loads on like primark and pretty little thing and stuff like that they're everywhere at the moment so that is pretty much all the outfits i have to show you guys for this month's style still i really hope you guys enjoyed this i really really like finding these outfits honestly i find it so fun let me know down below who's your favorite in the band whose fashion is your favorite whose outfits are your favorite but that is it for this month's style still i really hope you guys enjoyed it i will be in new york next week so if you want to follow me on instagram and keep up with all of that that is linked down below i will be doing a few new york videos too so make sure you're subscribed thank you guys so much remember to let me know who you want to see next and i will see you next time make him whistle like a missile bomb bomb every time i show up blow up uh.